we commenced the, uh, the journey on customer service in earnest uh, around 12 months ago. It was pretty clear in terms of reading the customer feedback that we had some areas for improvement and they, they kind of fell into three areas, responsiveness, ownership and communication. We really wanted to look at, at a granular view, how do you assimilate those into uh, a, a conscious effort and a conscious task for, for people on the service desk so that they really knew what it was that was expected of them, that they had clarity around the terms of uh, the measurement framework and how they would be receiving feedback on their performance against those uh, particular activities and also that we really wanted to, to reward and recognise you know, the, the good practices that people were delivering day in, day out. We start with a better induction program, we make sure that we've got the right metrics in place in terms of the SLA performance and the core quality performance, that we've got the right communication program in place, that we've got the right rewards program in place, that we're measuring our overall aggregated recall performance in terms of the customer scorecard and that we have uh, a program that constantly drives the service improvement culture. We've developed a, a new induction training program called For Those About To Rock. We found that there wasn't a main focus around what was important to our customers. So our, I think what differentiates us to others is the Our Customer module and also as well focusing around communications. From the feedback that I've got from others in the industry, the main focus is just around you do your job day to day, get the incident done, SLAs, those types of things, but not a main focus around what our customer actually needs and what they want. The facilities here at Homebush are our biggest and most high profile. Across service support in three countries we have over 400 service desk staff. 240 of those staff are located here in Homebush. The facilities here in Sydney Olympic Park are close to public transport, it's a fun location and there's plenty of amenities for staff. My first impression when I came in here was I guess the energy and enthusiasm that that was so active across the whole building. Uh, everybody was having a good time, uh, everybody was communicating and, and working together and that's something that, that I really uh, felt helped me achieve what I wanted to achieve. Every day we have a comms cell. It's the ability for the team to come together and just have a quick update at the same time for everyone on where we're at in, in the particular month's performance, what's happening within the business, and it's more of a dynamic communication approach than just an individual briefing from the team leader. We've been very deliberate with the rewards program so that we're recognising both the individual and the team for the outcomes. It, it makes me feel good when, I, when I'm winning the incentive prizes, but, but more so than that, uh, Having recognition for, for the, good, the good work and the effort you're putting in uh, it does genuinely want you to, to keep pushing it and, and make sure that you are providing that exceptional service. It makes me very proud to see in writing from the customer um, the impact that we've had on them by delivering service and delivering the right service and that's all geared to the, the service desk agents knowing the right practice, knowing how to resolve the customer's issue and or if they can't who will and, and over what time period and making sure that that's communicated back to the customer so that they leave us knowing exactly what's going to happen and that they feel that they've been given a service that meets their expectations and or exceeds them. One of the other benefits that we've seen as well is that staff feel far more engaged now. They feel that they have a voice. Um, they are the best way to understand what's, what's needing to be improved to deliver service because that's what they do day in, day out. I believe the ROC framework has improved the service desk environment for the better because we are more enthusiastic about completing customer requests, we show more empathy and our main goal is to just delight the customer. Over the past 12 months we've worked extremely hard to get a true service culture within service support. I'm astounded every single day with, with what I see coming through in either emails or verbally or as I see it on the floor. The team is really galvanised behind service as a culture and we have some true rock stars within our organisation.